hot is this? It's so humid. I am sweating something chronic. And raining. Hence the humidity, I believe. I was going to go up the tip today, but that's not going to happen. I'll wait till tomorrow. The weather's supposed to get a little bit better. So today, I thought, on this map they gave us, there's one, two, three, four. If you can see that. Aircraft crashes down around the airport. <laughs> I might go and have a look at those. And it's a good excuse just to sit in the car with the air conditioner going because it is hot. Anyway, let's see how we go with that. down to Bamiga. Please go away, Rain. DC-3 crash site. Down here, if I fit through the gate, that is tight. skinny track. I can imagine when this actually happened. It's so back in 1945 I believe. Just at the end of the war. Oh look at that. It'd be nice if it wasn't raining. <laughs> up in front. I've run into them three or four times. Last time swimming at Elliot Falls. So now plane wreck number two we'll go and find that. I can't believe how much of that's still left. One thing about aluminium is it doesn't rust much. actually at the airport and there's a plane coming in. One thing I'll tell you, I won't be launching the drone right here. <laughs> Which way do we go? Hopefully. 
hopefully somebody's left a sign. Found it. Not as much left of this one. Let's go and have a look. Lesson. Some of the World War II aircraft that didn't quite make it. We're going to head back to Bamiga and Hunson Bay just to chill out for the afternoon. Hudson Bay. What can I say about this place? Absolutely magnificent. Just see the very tip of Australia out there. Hudson Bay is the last bay before you get to the top. How beautiful is this? doing their bit for the ecology and good on them. <laughs> 